Well, 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 we are back again with some more sticker submissions. Tons of packs, as always. Let's start off with this first pack from Sir Maika. M-A-I-K-A. -A. Return pack, as always. Looking for some stickers sent back your way. Hey, Zai, I hope you enjoy my sticker pack. Look forward to the return. Sr Maika is the Instagram there. Let's get you to make sure that's focused on it properly. Got like a Nintendo DS style little name there. It's pretty cool. Get some printouts. Not sure uh, what country this is coming from. The text isn't quite English. Might as well do up close and personal for the first round. So some little circle stickers here. Very nice illustrations. Little characters. Respect gender. Some characters as well. Some more furry style stuff. Got a few of those in the past. More of those little guys. Some tags on your hellos, as always. It's very nice. Thank you for the pack to start us out. So make a, I'll have Instagrams over here in the corner, as well as down below in the description, so you can link over there, check them out. Maybe if you're down for a trade, and they are too, you can get that organized over on Instagram. All right, so many choices on where to go next. Let's uh, drop this pack out. Let's see what we got. Nice return pack, big return pack. So I'll be sure to fill that up. As always, looks like we got F-A-L, fall. So it looks like we got fall hitting you up from Brooklyn. Just wanted to say that I really enjoy your videos. Thank you very much. Sent over some of my stickers. Hope you like them and spread them around. Peace out from fall. P.S. No Instagram jet. So we'll see. That's a little funny. I don't know if I'll be able to come up with the Instagram from that, but F-A-L. So we got fall hitting up a bunch of different blank styles. Some hell of my name is. A little side hit up there. Thank you very much. Blanks. These are interesting. I haven't seen uh, hellos like this before. They're kind of a, a thermal material, but they've got the color printed on top. Sweet little paint marker FAL. Well, thank you for the small pack fall. Be sure to hit your Instagram if I can work it out in the description of the video. All right, looks like this pack was intended for somebody else, but they never hit him back, so ended up on my doorstep. What up, G? As you know, I just recently got into graffiti, and I'm total toy, but I'm really digging the writing. This is my first lap pack. I'm writing chalk. I hope you enjoy it and can get some up. I'll drop a self-addressed envelope in there as well, so you can get some stickers back. Hope you like the little Cheech Wizard tossed in. Well, thank you, Chalk. Good to see that you're starting off strong. Let's see if we got some little drawings here. Not quite a sticker. So we got O-L-E-U-M, Oleum. There in the Chalk tag at the bottom. There we got that Cheech Wizard he uh, had mentioned. And look at all the variety of Chalks here on the small little guys. These are not my favorite sticker to draw on, but they're definitely a cool concept to uh, do a full little stack up like that. Got it self-addressed. Ooh, very small pack. So that's all from chalk, but you know, you gotta start with some pack. No worries at all on the size. I'll be sure to get that pack right back your way. So let's do something a little volume-esque here. It looks like we've got Yo Sive in this pack of stickers I made in the last week or so, as well as stickers when I first got started. Tagging Cult, and then later tagged, and then later changed to S R D H or C H. This tag kind of looks like a D. But anyways, hope you enjoy the pack, and I'm open to anyone who's willing to trade. Hit up his Instagram, Culture420. Alrighty, well thank you for sending that my way. We've got nice cardboard backing to make sure nothing gets hurt here. Toss that aside. All right, let's check out these stickers. So it definitely looks like a C here, S-R-C-H, so maybe kind of like a search or search. We got his Instagram on the back side as well. Smaller little uh, priority mail stack up. Nice chrome here. Look, it must be one of those liquid chrome markers. Nothing else really compares to those. It definitely has such a metallic look to it. Nice throw in purple as well. Very cool. Black and reversed up on the yellow. Lots of colors here. Thank you, Search, for the variety. Ooh, a little uh, crisper kind of tag. Harder edges and some of the throw-ups. Very nice, very nice. 
thank you for the pack. I'll do my best to uh, link everybody down below as I know a lot of people like to use this service as a kind of open invitation to hit them up for trades. Search explicitly said it, but you know, it's a great way not only to share your stickers physically with me sending them around to other people, but also a great way to share them online and you know, get everybody to put some eyes on your work and maybe open up some trade opportunities. So I'll be sure to fill your return pack up and get that scent all off. Got a ton to work through after they finish filming these videos, so literally probably takes just as much time as filming all of them as getting them all packed and sent. So who do we got next? Yo Saib, I've been watching your content for a long time now, and I'm really interested in the sticker scene. Second, I finally decided to send in a pack, and I'm looking for some dope artists for my book. Well, very cool. Watching your video finally got me into it, and hopefully going to be sending in packs regularly. Very nice. I have some Pluto collabs included. So we got Kazer on this. I don't see an Instagram just yet, so we'll see if I can pull one out, or you'll just have to go hunt down Kazer with me. So sick tags on these hellos. Got a nice throw up as well. Contour cut. Much, much included detail there. Very nice. Pluto tags, there's these Pluto sauce. Kaiser and sauce. Sock, maybe, S-A-U-C. Very nice, little skull character. More characters here, some uh, colored pencil fills. Little side hit up. Well, thank you very much. Ooh, and I like the white one a lot. More characters in here. The yellow on the copper color. Something I don't see too often. Like that. Very clean character face. Right on, some stencils to finish it out. Well, thank you very much, Kaiser. I'll do my best to get those return packs as well as get your Instagram all together so people can hit you up for some trades. Much appreciated for the support of the sticker scene. Another return pack here. Who do we got here? Do not have an Insta. Well, at least that's an answer for us. So we got Z-E-E-C, Zeke, or Zek. Some nice holographic looking chromes there. Some throw ups. Kind of laminated over top too, so these are hopefully a little more durable, even though it looks like they're paint markers. Propaganda project in the mix. A little side hit up, maybe. Very cool on the bombing signs. Yeah. Looks like he sent in before as he got one of the kind of print off side labels. I did some bootleg blue tops way, way, way back. It's very cool. Thank you for the Zek pack. Now, this came in a mix of five or six packs, but Alley Cat has been maybe notorious for sending me a, a pack every week. So I stacked them all together as I found them through the mix. We got a return pack, but uh, probably familiar with Alley Cat. They sent in two or three times. I'm not sure. I can't quite. I think I left them in two separate videos. Oh, holographic Pikachu. Um, but yeah, definitely put them all together into one pack this time around just because they were all a little bit on the smaller side. So I figured it'd be easy enough to flip through them all at once. But little mix and match of hand-drawn stuff, printed stuff, and then uh, some kind of illustrations. All right, so we got a note here saying, thank you so freaking much for sending my pack and showing them off. I'm doing small stickers because they fit into the wallet. Well, there we go. Hope you have more your way and got the Instagram on there as well. So I know I love a good pocket jam sticker that's easy to handle and you know keep a few on your wallet at all times. It's so very nice. Look at all these. Got the post-it note style, kind of yellow and the sticker to follow. Very nice from Alley Cat. Thank you for sending these my way. I'll be sure to pass them along to everybody else. Another healthy size pack here with some crazy doubled up. So we got Drew coming in. Familiar with Drew. He's been getting some custom prints through me. Dexter's Lab. Pack touchdown. Pack touchdown. Very nice. Look at these crazy. It's the huge double, triple priorities. And then they're all taped over and laminated as well serious about keeping these stickers alive. Paint markers underneath it looks like. 
Oh, I like that one a lot. DR combo is tight. So these all want to fold back in on themselves, but I'll hold them as tight as I can. Drew on all these. Very sweet, very sweet. Not sure if it's the laminate that's kind of leaking some of the paint. It looks like it's bleeding some of the fill colors. Much love the volume here. These are always fun to get in packs and thankfully enough they fit in a standard envelope folded just once so I won't have to fold them any more than Drew already has. I'll have his Instagram for you in just a sec. Drew Drew underscore to split it up. These are some of the custom ones I made. Dexter's Laboratory on the yellow. So if you're interested in custom prints, hit me up. I've got tons of different colors. We've even got some of the whites and pinks in here as well. Real simple, you can print all your sticker images on there for you. And they, uh, they come out real nice with the Dexter's Lab. And they're cheap too. 20 bucks for 200 makes it uh, go a long way with your, your money for volume. So go check out Drew's stuff, heavy pack. Real excited to see, uh, see the circle of the graffiti ecosystem working out well. And that uh, you know, he's getting custom prints made, he's getting stickers sent out. Let's find, uh, find a name for this next pack. Bums, B-U-M-Z, on the first hit up. Crazy throwy. Worst on the second guy. Got some more worst in here. Maybe we got a pack from worst. Nice tags. Big ups, enjoy the slaps. Nashed teeth on Instagram. Well, we will maybe be hitting up bums or maybe we'll be hitting up worst. A pair of them together. Ooh, check out that minty black and reverse fill. Very tight, very tight. Characters in the mix as well. A little alphabet on the sticker. That, you don't see that too often. Some printouts. Nash teeth on there on the gradient fills. Nice. Let's get it close in. Check out that Nash teeth. Heavy piece. Nice printout. Midwurst, click. Maybe a play on words for Midwest. Worst on there. The Uzi, check. Ooh, the E's looking tight with that. The crazy fill too, that looks, you got some classic retro Krylon style there. Thank you for the pack, worst and bums. I'll be sure to send something in return. That is a heater. So we got a pack coming in from Australia. Looks like they sent some cash in, which is not what I generally recommend. I uh, prefer to definitely get these sent out with PayPal money, but we got the return pack here. I'll do my best to circle up with you and get that worked out. But if you are international to the US, totally open to receiving packs, but if you want one in return, then just hit me up on the email down below or on Instagram, and we can work out exactly getting that pack oriented to you, just because stamps work a little differently when they're coming out of, out of country. So it looks like we got new high score, S-K-O-R-E on the end of there. Maybe we got a pack here from score. Yo, Sive, greetings from Australia. Let the viewers know they can DM me for custom blanks. Oh, very interesting. New high score on Instagram. It's a little tight in there. Sorry if you couldn't quite read that. Looks like we got a UFO collab there and score. And maybe these are some of those custom blanks he was talking about. Cool almost outer space theme with the slight gradient in there of the lights and whites. Bunch of scores. Ooh, very tight. Got the quadruple. Hit up. Bunch of hellos with a side tribute. Thank you very much. A couple different scores there. Liking that throwy. Go hit him up, maybe he'll also do trades as well as hit you with some of these blanks. Awesome to see the variety here. He doesn't seem to use his blanks more as, as much as all these hellos, but definitely digging what I'm seeing that is a heater K. Look at that. Score, score. Well, very nice, thank you for the pack score. I'll be sure to hit you with the return pack, get that all set up for you. Recognize zit underscore sticker name on the outside of this. Let's see what we got coming in from Zitro. 
he sent in a few times previous as well as seems to trickle into other people's packs as well so my guess is this man is pretty active on uh, Instagram getting his name out there and trading quite a bit definitely love his tags as always Got some hellos from Montana cans big time Ooh, nice grog blank I don't think I've ever seen one of those barbed wire or not barbed wire but just the chain link fence in the backdrop sweet green tag Gotta love the dark green use. One of my favorite colors. The zit row characters, seen those before. Zit row and Phoenix. Another. Feel like he sent one of these last time, one of the kind of chromed up red hellos. And then some of the classic yellows. I like that tagging a lot. Well, very nice zit row. Thank you again for the pack. And thanks for sending multiple. Next up, we got a pack here from Street Smart. Not the Street Smart branding online, but the artist that goes by Street Smart. A bunch of printouts. Put these together for him back while, uh, quite a while ago. These were these were put together, so probably seen them maybe before online. They've had enough time to to grow. A bunch of illustrations here. Got kind of a thin sharpie style. Very cool. Very cool. Now this pack, unfortunately, it, it got set aside. It, there wasn't enough postage on it, but I felt bad, you know, not paying for it. So I uh, paid the extra couple bucks to get the pack in, but then I had set it aside accidentally because I picked it up not with a bunch of other packs that day. So my apology, Street Smart, for setting this off. But uh, you know, ultimately, I if I can, I try to you know pay the extra couple bucks if someone didn't put enough stamps on it but sometimes they, they send them back to you before I get a chance to do and pick them up. So ultimately it's best if you pay your sticker packs in full and get them shipped over. But uh, I think this one in particular, if you put a priority mail label on your envelope, they're gonna send it priority mail so it gets there much faster and it costs quite a bit more. So that was the issue here. Just uh, when you are just sending stickers, don't put a priority mail as the label to you know write the to and from on. It just makes it cost so much more. Um, literally can be double or triple the price because they end up sending it with tracking numbers and end up sending it twice as fast. So it's much more expensive that way. Check out these kind of family guy or this one is uh, American Dad. Got all the different kind of cartoon style. That's a real unique thing. I like those a lot. Very cool work. Never seen anybody do that with a full kind of cast setup. I've seen single ones done before. Very nice, street smart. All right, well that closes out his pack. Thank you very much for sending that. Just to reiterate, when you, you know, do send a package, don't send it with the prior to mail label on it because three stamps won't cover that. It normally costs, you know, five or six dollars to send it with priority mail versus the dollar fifty of a regular pack. So uh, don't worry about that. I handled it this time around, but sometimes I do have to send them back to you if it costs me another five bucks. So next up, we've got Pacer. You, I'm sure, have seen some of his work on my channel before. He's busy on Instagram as well. Been always posting on his story. We've got some Simpsons printouts. He's always busy tagging and throwing down some crazy throw ups. So much love for Pacer sending me another pack. Been a little while since I got the last one, but uh, loving each and every one. Ooh, check out that yellow there. Dark blue combo, looking nice. Always unique to see the, the little change-ups of style that come with sending a pack every you know month or so. Digging that backdrop as well. Not great contrast, but gets the job done. Ooh, check out that two-tone inverting it when it goes into the white section that's a nice version thank you very much for the pack pacer I'll be sure to uh, package some up I saw you sent some stamps and I've got your address stowed away so I'll be sure to get 
another one sent out your way. Thank you very much. I'll be sure to tag you in the description as well. Another big pack coming in with a return pack. BYMC. Ooh, check out these drawings. So we got RA Warner on here, and I am familiar with that name based on a previous sticker submission video. He sent in some crazy cool two-tone stencils last time. So maybe we'll see some uh, similar to that. Ooh, geez. Old side shell there. Screen printed and all. That sticker might, that blank might be three or four years old. RA1, check out that R. Nothing but great right there. Those cracks are flawless. Love the style. You, I'm sure, will find some uh, inspiration from these stickers. Just super fresh. Blow your mind. Here's some of those stencils I mentioned. This one's even cleaner than the last one I had. RA Warner. Yeah, honestly, that pack I received from him might be three or four years old, but definitely have the memory of the two tone. It was like blue and black with a kind of maybe dark gray background. Blow your mind. I've got to try to do some of the two stone stencils like that. Those just look so crisp. And I'm sure he can pump them out really efficiently. So we got a larger one here. Collab. Lots of room on there. Very nice. Throw that in the large sticker pile. Flavor on that R. Very tight. Tons of different ones of these. And not even stress on the duplicates. Gee, look at that side hit up. Loving the green combo. And to follow it out, even did a RA1 on one of my old side shell blue tops. Geez, these are craziness. Really digging those styles. Might have to stow those in the personal pile or at least uh, forever remember them in the thumbnail. RA1 heater of a pack. I didn't see an Instagram. I gotta find one of those for you. Definitely worthwhile to follow back up with him. Ooh, even hit the back of this guy with the stencil. So I'll see if I can find him RA1. If you hit me in the comment section, hopefully I can get your Instagram in there because I'm sure plenty of people want to follow and see what else you're putting out. I'll do my best to, to manage that. But if I don't, my apologies in the time being while I dig it up. Follow suit with the large envelope. Got a return pack in here. Like I like to say in every video, if you want to send in stickers, it's super easy. Send me an envelope with your stickers packed in it. And then if you want any stickers in return, send an empty envelope with three or four stamps on it. That way I can take this in, pack it full of all the other stickers I get throughout the month, and get you a nice mix max pack of tons of different artists in exchange for you sending some to send around to other people. So here we got a note from Kazam Graffiti. Hey Sav, I'm a beginner in graffiti. I go by the name Kazam. You were actually the one that got me into graffiti. Well, very nice. I saw one of your videos and wanted more. So I went through your channel and hopefully found quite a few. Found sticker submission. He loved them and decided that he wanted to make some stickers himself. Very nice. Looking for some feedback so he can get better. And you can follow him at Kazam Graffiti. Well, let's see what we can do for Kazam. Looks like he got a Dask sticker in there. We saw some stuff from a previous pack. Got Kazam with the blue blowout. Very nice character. Collab going in there. Side sticky note. Cool mix match kind of layered up blank. Nice side hit up. Kazam. Looking good. Ooh, we even sent an Owick my way. Always finding a way to get Krylons in here. Some other artists in here. Very sweet. KZM. So, I mean, you said you're new to the scene as well, so basically just keep practicing. Always my suggestion. Go at it, try a bunch of different stuff out, and just really take your time in learning the traditional skills of drawing. Goes a long way to keep your lines crisp and clean and then you can really build from there. Ooh, he was a little stency throw up fade there. Loving those colors. Definitely got a nice starting point here, Kazam, so stick at it. And that goes for everybody. If you're just getting into stickers, feel free to send in as well. It's awesome to show the variety of skill and everything. And I'm sure there are plenty of people right now that would love to still trade with you after watching your stuff. So I'll be sure to link 
your Instagram down below and so we can get hopefully some trades moving everybody's way. Some Paradox Snickers falling out first on this pack. We got Hey Sive, hope you enjoy the pack. My Insta is Paradox Australia. Maybe a one as the first T. We'll find out later. Uh, viewers, hit me up for trades and check out what I'm selling. So maybe he's got some artwork for you, you to see on his page. Got some interesting like playing cards. I recognize these battle spirits. Not written in English. Definitely. Um, I'll see if I recognize that. And we got Paradox. Maybe an XXX. Hit up there. Nice blank. A little UFO Paradox collab. UFO sneaking in once again. Paradox throwy, very nice. Business cards, hit ups on some hellos. Paradox, oh, I recognize the character now. Seen that a handful of times before. Jeez, those Snickers are prominent. Got the and some couple, kind of smooth gator, kind of cardboard in there as well. So very nice, thank you for the mix match pack, Paradox. And looks like we've got one final pack for the sticker session. Well, wow. I've definitely pulled through plenty of stickers today. So you'll be seeing them hopefully in weekly videos more or less. No, oh, we do have, we have just Jiven on the back here. Cool little water character. Another character there, just Jiven on that as well. Very nice colored in here. Ooh, check out that white and red combo. Jiving on the throw up. Turquoise, got some nice colors in here. Golden turquoise is always a fun combo. Big Jiving. Very sweet, very sweet. Thank you for the pack Jiving, the zombie curse. Mix up of some other artists. Cool skull spray can character. I like that one a lot. Blues and grays look nice together. That's a crispy clean. It's nice to see the kind of slight white edge that uh, the sticker masked. Gives it almost like a drop shadow look even though you won't get that when you stick it. Very nice. Sior and Curse. Got a cr one -er on the other side. Not sure who might have sent the pack at this point as there were so many different Jiven and curse in there so we will see who I tag but thank you again to everybody that sent in this month tons of stickers to go around tons of variety as always lots of crazy characters in this batch tons of lettering as well so be sure to hit up everybody that you're interested in trading with after seeing their work in this video I'll do my best to link them down below if you know somebody's page that I might have missed maybe hit me up in the comments as well and I'll do my best to add that on there I've got plenty of stickers to pack up at this point, so if you're interested in a future sticker submission inclusion, send me a pack with you know, a few stamps on it, two or three, four, if you're really eager. And I'll pack this full of other stickers if you uh, send me some of your stickers as well. Ultimately, got a ton to go through here, so thank you again to everybody that sent in. Hopefully the service continues to share cool art with you, as well as trade nice artwork and gets you a mix match pack of you know, a bunch of different artists in exchange for a set of yours to send out to other people. If you got any questions about the service, hit me up in the comment section down below or drop me an email or a DM if you're international and want to do it. It's just a little different to set up the shipping on my end of things, but I don't mind you know putting that together for you in the future. If you got any questions or comments or want to give some kudos to some of these cool artists in the comment section, leave a little comment on some of your favorite stickers from this video. Spray that like button if you enjoyed it as well. It helps to share this video to maybe some new perspective artists as well as maybe giving a subscription to the channel. We'll make sure you don't miss the next round. That's really gonna do it for me, guys. Peace. Well, you get a little bonus here. Sorry to see some two packs actually snuck under the setup. So we got a pack here from Sinner, and then let's see who we got on this other one. 
Thunder's Fruit Graffiti, Yo Sive. This was first sticker trade. Inside will include some tape printouts, hand drawings, and a return envelope. Huge fan. Please blur out the PO box. Yes, sir. And uh, yeah, Thunder Fruits Graffiti. So let's see what we got from Thunder Fruits. Get you a closer look at these ones. My apologies for them getting stuck under here. Cool throw ups. Bunch of the same. These are those printouts, I'm sure, all kind of glossed up in there with some tape. And we got some USPS Thundy on there, or Thunder. LTIG. And his return back. So, very nice. Thank you for those, mix. Sorry they dodged to the end. Well, let's save a few of these to put on the backdrop. Alrighty. And last up, Sinner sent some of these. Oh no, this pack actually came from Slabs. We uh, did a little exchange. He was printing me some eggs in exchange for some thermals I printed for him. So we got Slabs and Sinner. I also hit up his name for the throwies in that pack. So it was a cool little exchange. Everybody gets a little bit something different. Score Slabs. Nice hollows. Printout based, definitely to say the least. Sinner and slabs on the character as well. Very sweet. Printed some of those on some thermals for him. This looked great on some of the fluorescent colors. So very nice. Good thing to round out at the end. Sorry to find them off to the side. But uh, let's get back to sticking in the background.